multiplication made easy today we will learn an easy method of multiplying tens hundreds or thousands come let us begin look at this example here we have to multiply 3 tens and 8 when we multiply 3 tens into 8 we get 24 tens we know that 24 tens is equal to 24 into 10 which is equal to 240 which is our answer let us look at another example multiply two hundreds and three hundreds which is equal to two hundred into three hundred first multiply the non-zero digits two and three we get the answer six now insert four zeros after six thus we get the answer as six ten thousands now let us multiply five hundreds and four tens which is equal to five hundred into forty first multiply the non-zero digits five and four we get the answer twenty lastly insert three zeros after twenty thus we get the answer as two ten thousands kids always remember while multiplying if any one or both the factors end in zero multiply the non-zero digits first and then insert as many zeros as in the two factors kids when ten one hundred one thousand ten thousand and so on is one of the factors we must ask the following questions to find the other factor let us take an example look at the number 70 there is one zero in 70 so we know that one of the factors is 10 to find the other factor ask the question how many tens in 70 there are seven tens in 70 which is equal to seven into ten therefore the other factor is seven now let us try another number 280 there is one zero in 280 so 10 is one of the factors so the question we ask to get the other factor is how many tens in 280 there are 28 tens in 280 which is equal to 28 into 10 so the other factor is 28 find the other factor for the number 4500 there are two zeros in 4500 therefore 100 is one of the factors here comes the question how many hundreds in 4500 there are 45 hundreds in 4500 which is equal to 45 into 100 hence we get the other factor as 45 let us look at one more example number 68000 one of the factors is 1000 as there are three zeros in 68000 so the question to be asked is how many thousands in 68000 there are 68 thousands in 68000 which is equal to 68 into 1000 so the other factor is 68 wasn't multiplication fun today?